Hey guys, welcome back to the challenge, your boy King Chaos, and we're back with more Dying Light. We're actually back in the, uh, back in Haran. In the last episode there, guys, we've done the mission, The Awakening, which was basically the intro. And I showed you how to get a gun for as soon as you leave the tower. So if you want to know how to get a gun, go, I suggest you go back and watch your, uh, the first episode. So guys, in this episode, we're first assignment, I need to go and talk to Spike. Which is this dude. Right, fair enough. Hey Spike, I'm Crane. <laughs> Just what I need. More unskilled labor. All right, shut up and pay attention. There are two types of airdrops. One has food, first aid supplies, survival gear and such. The other kind is filled with antizen. The GRE sends in a one-way video feed that lets us know when they're on the way. Look, the trouble is, the airdrops with antizen keep getting raided by Rise's thugs. And without antizen, we're basically screwed. Rise and his boys only operate during the day because going out after dark is a dandy way to get killed. But the next two Anderson drops are coming down right at sunset tonight, and Brecken means to go after them. This may be our only chance to reach the airdrop. What's my part here? Well, as I said, going out at night is basically suicide. Or it would be if I hadn't been setting up safe zones and traps out there for weeks now, which I have. Now, Brecken and his team will be okay tonight so long as you get out there now and arm those traps. That's your part. All right. What are these traps and how do I arm them? You'll see. I'll be talking you through it. Just remember, without these traps, Brecken won't survive the night. And if he doesn't come back with Antizen, we are lost. Before you head out there, grab some firecrackers. Made them myself. They make a fine distraction if you get in trouble. I should be just showing you the loot. Right. Right, two things that I find this map. Is this these safe zones? What's this? Yes, this is the traps, basically. Outside, I'm working for Spike. You're Crane, right? Listen, our runner's trying to secure one of our safe houses for Brecken's mission. He's in a courtyard by Vefa and Mimar, surrounded by zombies. We gotta help him. All right, I'm on it. Hardcore park four, my man. Holly ho. There we go. Okay, Jade, I'm here, along with some infected. Watch yourself, Crane. Park him over the head. There we go. Get him, man. Why are you? Give it. There you go. Give her head on. This doesn't sound good. Alright, that oh, man, he's already a fucking bomb boy, isn't it? Shit. Alright. Okay, it's done. Fuck. You had no choice. He wasn't human anymore. Now hurry. You still need to turn on the lights. That's the only way to make this place safe at night. Ah, shit. How's it coming? Got the lights on? Uh, almost. Just give me a second. Fuck off. Right. It wants me to go back over there where all these zombies are. Whoa, what the fuck happened there? Just want me to get up there. <coughs> Oh, come on, I'm trying to still make these jumps that I done in the original game. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, we all know how to do these guys. There you go. <clears throat> Another spawn or adjustable range, depending on how you like it. Right. Up we go. Crane here. Report. Okay, I met this doctor, scientist type. They've got him set up in a sort of research trailer, and he's working on a cure for the virus. His name is Zera. Hello? Do you copy? Affirmative. Secondary objective added. Maintain your cover and secure all of his research. Acknowledge. Your stolen file still takes top priority, though, right? Affirmative. We find it unlikely that a single researcher working out of a trailer could produce any significant results. But if he does, we want to see it. Don't underestimate people. Jade, it's done. Good. We'll need to prepare more places like that one. We've got more spots picked out for future safe zones. Spike will mark them on your map later. And Crane, thank you. Back to you, Spike. Right now, you need to get back to our main task and arm the next trap. There's another car close by. Got it. The the infected are all over the street. Everywhere. So what does that tell you? Keep off the street. Try to stay on the rooftops where they can't reach you. They're all around the car, Spike. You still have some firecrackers, don't you? Just throw some into the crowd. Those dead bastards are easily distracted. Well, they better hope that other the car, Spike. Caught me now, then. Keep on like that, you just might make it. The next yeah. trap's close by, and I shouldn't have to tell you, but don't get caught out in the open. Spike, these freaks are everywhere. If I need to use a trap, how do I activate it? You can't. I told you, they're only for the night mission. Shit. Okay. Agility. I'm walk packing it. Got it. Right, where the hell did I go from here? Oh, wait a minute. Here. I think this is it. Yes, it is. It's quite a contraption you got here. Three times brighter than an ordinary street lamp. Gives the infected quite the sunburn. I'm searching all these guys. Because unlike the second one, you don't have the Coric charm that keeps rethinking your weapon up. Where are we? Don't break a leg, Crane. Still three more to fucking go, man. Holy smokes. Right, there's one here. Oh, shit. I don't know about you guys, but I always found this game to be a hell of a lot scarier on that second one. Get fuck. Get there. Right, this way. Oh shit. Just made that. Uh... Oh shit, is it one of these? Yes it is. I ain't never making this. I did make it. Yeah. Okay, lights are all set. You ready for the next one then? Better hurry. I'm dead. Fuck. That hurt. Right, hey, let's go. Yeah. Uh. Looks like the whole goddamn district went down. What the hell's going on? Oh, not again. All right, listen. There's a power substation near you. Go check it out. Why is it always fucking me? Hey, 
This blackout has really put us in a tight spot. We're defenseless here. Plus the safe zones and some of my traps are down too. We need to get that power up and running ASAP. Oh, sure. What is this? I remember this. Sounds like there's another one. Oh. Where is it in here? Oh shit. Oh, there. I've got the substation reset, but if the grid shorted once, you know it could happen again, right? You leave the electrical engineering to me, okay? Just get your ass to a safe zone. You're gonna have to spend the night there. Right, get that safe zone. Cool. Right, right this way. Oh, come on, you. Oh shit, I go that super quick. Is there enough zombies, man? Fuck shit. Yeah. Freaking weird zombies covered in big green blisters. It it hauled ass as soon as it spotted me. You know anything about it? <laughs> Not enough information, I'm afraid. But if you see another one, do let me know, will you? I you sleep. Okay, give me a sec. Talk to sp <sighs> That's right, because I've got the... What you call it? Uh, the Enhanced Edition guys. So... Where the hell did I get all that for? Oh wait, then. Uh, no, that isn't. Is it, no, that's me stone shit. What the hell am I doing? Right, so there's clearly nothing in my stash. What are we talking about? There we go. Look like a badass. Wildlands. 
Okay, let's go talk to Spike. <laughs> Balancing arc to you. Catch me. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> catch me. Yeah. Screw you guys. Great <laughs> crane's gonna screw it up. I'm sh ah, this is the other place here. Get me some stones bark. Spade. Crane, first of all, you did great out there. From now on, if you need something, come see me. And to start with, use a UV flashlight and a remote control. You run up on a volatile, give him a face full of UV, or lead him into a trap which you can trigger with that remote. You got it? Got it. Perfect. Now for the bad news. Despite your efforts, Brecken's mission failed. Oh, shit, is he okay? He's alive, but you need to get back to the tower. Jay called all the scouts in, and that means you. Well, shit, thanks. Survival rank, like, let's have a look at some of these skills. More inventory space. So I blunt went into the head, staggers them. Makes them go all wobbly. Oh, I'm just caught onto that there. Right. Oh shit, I'm in. No, I'm not. Meeting with the tower's leader. Acknowledged. Confirm his identity and contact us immediately. Just get some more of that shit worse than doing it. There you go. Since I spent the night, does that not mean yes? So must be up. Brecken's mission failed. Jade called a meeting in the tower. It's my opportunity to finally meet with Brecken and confirm his identity. I didn't know I had another skill point now. This looks like a shop. I've got better weapons there. Wait two seconds guys to sort this out. How do all this? Throwing stars. Crane. Listen, Brecken and a team of runners went after an airdrop last night. 
He lost the rest of his team to Biters, and then Rise's men ambushed him, beat him to a pulp, and stole the drop. Now Brecken wants to go after the next drop himself, but we can't let him, and you've got to back me up, okay? For God's sake! You can't even walk straight! We need you alive, you idiot! Okay, we're going in. Act confident. Brecken? Lena? Maybe you can get through to him. Jade, who's your friend? Kyle Crane. Look, Brecken, the last thing we need is for you to go back out there. We can figure out another way without jeopardizing you. Right, Crane? I'll go. I'll do it. Right? Yes. Crane will go. He'll be happy to. Jesus. No offense, friend, but you're as green as grass. You can't just... Crane will manage. He'll start in the right spot. And Lena's right. You need to be here taking care of the towers, convincing them the world's not over yet. Oh, hell. Maybe one more try before we go to Rice. Yeah. Okay, fine. Good luck, Crane. Jade, a moment. Sure. Head for the cauldron. I'll be in touch shortly. Head to the cauldron. What the fuck's the cauldron? Look, there's something else we need <coughs> to discuss. Brecken was hurt pretty bad out there. Worse than he wants people to know. He took a blow to the head. Now he's starting to have seizures, and I don't have any Laura tracks. Yeah, I doubt anyone does. Anti-seizure drugs were being passed out like candy when the infection first started. And the stores ran out weeks ago. Yes, that's right. How do you know that? Look, what do you need me to do, Lena? There's a man in town named Ghazi. He's not altogether there, if you know what I mean. His mother had epilepsy, so he used to pick up medicine for her each month. She died two years ago, but Ghazi kept going to the store to pick up her prescription. He likes his routine, and Ghazi can be very... insistent. So, they kept giving it to him. You think he's been stockpiling it all this time? If he hasn't, I don't know where else we're going to get it from. Ghazi lives under the overpass. And don't mention his mother's death. He won't understand. So that's another mission I'll need to do Mother's Day at some point, right? Elevator. Mother's Day. Maybe do that in the next step, guys. <coughs> <coughs> Most of the runners out of action, Brecken wants the scouts to take their place. That means me. We're supposed to go for the next airdrop right before sunset. Jade will be showing me the ropes. Apparently. Right before sunset. Fantastic, isn't it? Have you got any more goodies for me, Shahid? Nope. Right, let's go. No, bad start. Leave that for. Can think it hard. Can I claim them? Yes, I can. Crane here. Report. Tower boss is named Brecken, and he's definitely not your man. The other likely suspect is this warlord, basically. Local guy. Calls himself Rise. He's hoarding Antizen and then gouging the hell out of anybody who wants to buy some. I'm on a mission to get Antizen from the airdrop. If I don't succeed, they'll have to come up with something else. Acknowledged. Good job, Crane. You're doing well. Stay on task, and we'll be in touch. Be sure to call us immediately if and when you get that Antizen. Seven. Right. This way. Let's start charging.
shot. It's storms, man. Storm is terrible. And I thought there was no storm on this one. Crane, three quarters of all airdrops fall in the cauldron. So if you start from there, you'll have the best chance of getting to that drop before Rice's men do. <laughs> Jade, I'm getting close to the drop zone. Good. Find some shelter and wait. Most of the drops seem to fall exactly in that area. What? Well, this is one they do exactly. Look at the look for the airdrop in the cauldron area. Right, it's right there, bro. There's a crate. It looks intact. I'll check out what's inside. I don't know how the fuck I got up to it. Must be this way. <laughs> it's a hard one. Come on, baby, give me that sweet spot. There it is. Bingo. Click on that flashlight. Right. Up we go. There it is. <clears throat> and there. Yep. Damn it. Nothing here. Show him, bitch. Another one. Did you see that? Yeah, two drops. Two more. They landed elsewhere, unfortunately. But you're not that far away. Get to those crates before anyone else does. Oh, come on. Oh, for goodness sake, clean your shade. You ain't no aid not for sure. That rises the man. Jade Rice's man got here first. Fuck. Okay. Don't try to fight them. Just what? find the Why? second one. Look for the smoke from the flare. The crate should be close hey, by. Don't try and fight them. I was going nuts kicking the heads and she'd help me not the bother, so... <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, for goodness sake, where the hell have I ended up? Crane, the thunder it's too close to sunset. You need to turn back now. Jane, I'm almost there. I can do this. Just there, brother. Let's use them. Oh, shit, there's some bonies down here. Oh, fuck off. Shot my pants here. Where is it? Ah, uh, here. Ah. Uh. Yep. Crane here. I'm about to recover an antizen drop. Good, Crane. This offers us a new strategy. Time to turn your attention to Rise. Listen closely. 
It's very possible that Rise is our man. So if you find an airdrop containing Anderson, destroy it. What? What? Why? It will force interaction with Rise. You can go under Brecken's auspices as an ambassador, if you will. But, but there are civilians depending on this stuff. Our plan is focused on the greater good. Remember that. Fucking shocking. I wouldn't have burned it all, I'd take a few. I definitely would take, I'd at least take one for the sake of everybody else. <clears throat> Jade, I'm at the airdrop. There's no Antis in here. None? Fuck. Fuck! All right. Get back here and be careful. The nightmares are awake. Don't let them see. No, oh, for fuck. Oh, shit. They must have heard me. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. I shot my drawers there, brother. Run, Crane, brother. You're too slow. Holy shit, they're everywhere. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm so dead. It's unbelievable. Train's fucked at stamina. Just got spotted again and again. Go crane, go crane, go crane, you stupid cunt. Fuck me, that was intense. Jeez, oh. That was absolutely scatty, man. Two seconds, guys. Uh, two seconds. Right, let's go finish this mission out. made it in one piece. Now I know how Brecken must have felt running at night. It is no picnic. Ah, oh, definitely. It was no picnic. <clears throat> right. If that mission don't give you the sweats, I don't know what will. I'm telling you, it's crazy shot. Brecken, come on. I mean, we need Anderson. I know, but buying from Rise? You can't be serious. For God's sakes, I'll go. I'm not scared. Absolutely not. We've discussed that already. No, we didn't discuss it. You just decided that I'll I... go. Are you serious? Well, this Rice guy has never seen my face before. Clean slate, right? Could you guys give Crane and me the room, please? You sure you're up for this? It has to be done, doesn't it? Well, I'm not gonna argue. Race's place is over here. Just find out what this will cost us and come back in one piece. Survivor rank. Taking elemental throwing stars, man. Taking the slide. 
Go down, we'll try and see if the quarter master has any presents for us. You've learned to craft free. Oh. There. Exploding and that. Brecken is so desperate he's ready to deal with the devil himself, Rise. And since I'm supposed to determine whether or not Rice is the one who stole the GRE's secret document, well, this is... Claw hammer cause alcohol lock pack. Good stuff. Yet another fucked up night. Crane, oh. can you hear me? Jade? Yeah, I copy. Something wrong? No, no, it's him. Listen, Crane, we all appreciate what you're doing. And I know you're doing it to redeem yourself. Because Amir died saving your life. Look, I'm doing it because if we don't get Antizen from Rice, people will start to die. You know, I met Amir right after the outbreak. I didn't know him for that long, but... He was the best, most decent man I've ever known. But I just want you to know that I don't blame you. Amir knew the risk. And Crane, we know that you too are taking a risk to do this for us. I... Look, Jade, we'll talk when I get back with the Antizen, okay? Okay. Just... Just come back in one piece, all right? See what he's got. Brick Karma. Monkey wrench. Oh, bladed weapons, you know? Three hundred. No, oh, that'll do. Right, guys, I'm going to call this episode here. So, this is your boy King Chaos, guys. If you've enjoyed this episode and you've been enjoying this original Dying Light playthrough so far, like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Even hit the comments, guys. Say hello, it helps the algorithm. And I'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye.